Hello everyone, this is Tatiana and welcome to my channel. If you haven't done so yet, then make sure to subscribe and ring the bell in order not to miss out on any of these videos. The nails that you see here used to look like this, but turned into these beautiful longer nails. And of course, you're probably asking yourself, are these extensions? No, these are indeed the natural nails, just uh, strengthened with a gel polish base. So today we are going to be correcting these nails, uh, changing to a ballerina form, and finishing off with a stylish design from Instagram. Without any further delay, I'm getting straight to work by removing the old coating. However, I'm leaving the base layer uh, on the nails as is, and then with our nail drill, uh, I'm going to tidy up the shape. In order to get a perfect ballerina shape, you need to narrow the sides quite a bit. Um, I don't recommend the ballerina shape for nails that are wider, as it just makes them look a little awkward. Uh, but these nails here are thin, the nail plate isn't trapezoidal or wide, so the ballerina form will be just perfect. Make sure that you're smoothly narrowing down the sides, and then just go over the growth area on the free edge. Further for today, we are doing a combination manicure. I will need a pair of small scissors and my nail drill. Also, I am planning on dedicating a video about the steps of a Russian manicure, as some of you have been requesting, so do be ready for that. After having cleaned up the cuticle, I'm removing any dust and further dehydrating the nails. Those little fringes of nails sometimes do appear, so with a nail file, I'm lightly buffing them off so that there will be no problems with our coating. I'm adding a camouflage base to some nails, specifically where our design will be. I could have used the same base on all of the nails, but I did want to test uh, a new base that I had, 
which isn't as thick as the first one. It's going on quite smoothly. Uh, it didn't have a brush though, so I grabbed an additional one. And here they are, ready for our gel polish. On the clear nails, I am going to paint them in a black gel polish, and in order for that to dry well, we will apply thin layers. The camouflage base gave us a beautiful background, so we can get straight to work on the decorative elements. For a hazy color, all you need to do is add a little bit of finish or base to your color, and this design, it really doesn't require any artistic talent, it's super easy and fun. We're letting that layer cure underneath the lamp and layering some black on top. After that layer has fully dried, I'm using a black gel paint to draw our outline. This beautifully frames the nail. Now just to let everything cure underneath the lamp and coating all of our nails in a matte finish. Here they are, these really turned out so pretty and this was so much fun to do. Here are the nails that inspired today's video, such a creative and stylish design. If you liked today's video then give it a big thumbs up and let me know down in the comment section below what you would like to see next.